Hello everyone and welcome back to Void Space Alpha. My name is Ollie and today we are continuing on with our Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough series as Ardo. I was about to say the Oathbreaker Paladin, but he's no longer an Oathbreaker because we retook our oath in the last episode. Now I was trying to be clever and multi-classing as a Paladin slash Warlock, but to be completely honest with you, the one minor encounter that we had, Fate. I just discovered That's that he's weaker required. overall um, from my choice of combination of class. So I think we're just going to go back to a pure Paladin. Um, what is the oath we're going to take? We are going to take ooh, oath of devotion or oath of vengeance. I think we're going to be an oath of vengeance paladin now. Um, you or an ally's weapon deals an additional two radiant damage. Can daze enemies for one turn. No, let's go for yeah. Let's go for uh, oath of devotion. Let's continue that up, and we'll just quickly level through. Uh, all of this because I know you don't want to watch this a second time through but I'm just going to pick the things that we picked last time just quickly <clears throat> excuse me fix my spells so we went for defensive on that we've got the next level up prepared spells is all good uh, we want to get rid of halt or sorry or command and I would like to add is there another smite there is searing smite there we go right let's continue to go we've got a feat which was I think we went for tough. Gives us an extra two life for every level. And yeah, now we've got these spells as well. Lesser Restoration. We already know this spell, so we can kind of get rid of it. But I don't actually know if there's a way to get rid of it, because it doesn't appear in our prepared spell slot. Uh, level two spells. We have got nothing. We can get rid of Command. And we're going to get rid of Shield of Faith, potentially. And we're going to have Branding Smite and uh, Aid, I think. No, we don't need Aid because we've got Cure Wounds. So I think we still will have Shield of Faith for now. Let's continue to pop through. Prepared Spells, still fine. What have we got here? Magic Weapon, don't need that. And final level. Yeah, there we go. I think that's as good as it's going to get. Brilliant. Let's get out of here. Did I want to take a long rest? I don't think I did. We've got no short rests left, but we are all fully healed, and I believe we've... Oh, no, yeah, Shadowheart doesn't have her full spell slot, so let's let's just get a quick rest in. And whilst we're getting the rest in, I can say a genuine and heartfelt thank you to the almost 16,000 subscribers on the channel now. Thank you so much for that, and thank you to everyone that takes the time to comment or interact with this video or this series in any way, shape, or form. I love responding to every single comment reading all of your advice and tips uh, just to for anyone that's new that's watching i don't mind spoilers so feel free to tell me things that i've missed or you know stuff that i could have done better or had a different outcome this will not be my only playthrough it might be my only playthrough on camera but certainly won't be my only playthrough of this game this is actually my second ever playthrough because i've owned this game since beta and uh yeah it's um it's really really interesting now because i'm starting to get to the level where um, I'm, I'm discovering new stuff, so yeah, there's a lot of stuff that I didn't see last time because my last playthrough wasn't a full playthrough. Right, last time we were here, Raphael told us that there was something in here that he wanted to be killed, but equally also was a terrible thing. So yeah, there's a, there's a pretty good chance we might bump into that. I'd like to scout the area first before I head in. There's a big iron fence here that we can open. Herald of Balthazar. Not needed. Leave. Okay. Right, what can I do here? It's a pouch. Please. Nothing in the pouch. Okay, right. We've got runes in every cardinal direction. Apart from the way that we came in. So let's have a little looky loo around That's here. I suppose a mausoleum's a fitting place for the Lord of the Dead. Okay, I don't think there's anything here that we can grab. There's a traveller's chest that we can lock pick. A load of pile of books. This is DC 14. We'll get some guidance on it. Guidance to cantrip. Yeah, we're in there. Oh, another cloak. So we got a cloak last time. Potion of flying, that'll be useful. Some crafting reagents. And what does this cloak do? You gain eight temporary hit points after casting a spell while in melee. Do you know who that's going to be good for? That's going to be good for Will. 
Everyone's getting a cloak now. Do you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of, you know, when you hit level 15 and you, um, as an Alliance character in WoW, and you headed down oh. to, um, what was it, Dun Dunmorag or, or whatever it was called, Dunmoran, and you could actually buy shoulders for the first time, shoulder armor for the first time. And that's what it reminds me of now, finding cloaks and stuff. Like, actually useful cloaks. Filling that one character oh, slot, or, oh, sorry, uh, weapon, bones. what am I talking about, inventory I'm slot. For the dead here. Yeah, there's a backpack up here, Diary of Catherick Thorn, Volume 2, I don't really care about his diary, he's just got to die. Uh, more crafting reagents, in fact, let's just have a look at our alchemy pouch. Can we make any health potions? We cannot. We extract all of our ingredients, though. Um, right. You know, it's interesting, I don't think I've used a potion in combat almost at all if ever definitely nothing more than a healing potion he defiled their remains so he could pay homage to merkel right okay that's the two little wings explored i suppose temple map is that going to discover the map for me oh nope there's a temple under here and something monstrous hiding right inside. yeah i'm terrified of like missing something there's a button over it well Lady Shah's presence is near. Oh, I'm actually controlling Will. Got a long road ahead. Let's try. What do try I shooting that button from far away. Oh, there's buttons here as well. Right, so there's three buttons. There's that one. Am I just gonna luckily shoot these in order? Next time's the charm. Nope, didn't shoot them in order. Does that subside? So that was one, two, three. Let's try a different combination. I'm blind now. Oh, oh, there's traps. Okay. How do I get rid of this blindness? Do I have Shadow Heart cast light? Okay. Doesn't really counteract the brightness as much as it just makes it brighter. I get Shadow of Our Heart to disarm this trap. It's a DC 10. She can cast guidance on herself. There we go. So she disarmed a trap. All's well that ends. Ah, right. There's little vents that create darkness. Okay. Right. There's obviously something I'm missing here, which is how to. Oh, marble plate. Yeah, let's disarm that. Yeah, that'll get disarmed. Oh, disarm that. Everyone's taken a bit of damage. It's not going brilliantly. Especially considering we don't have Oh we do have short rests. We do. We did we did did a long rest, didn't we? Watch how you go. There's a trap. Disarm more of these traps to see if we can actually make our way through this area without getting killed. Disarm this pressure plate. Yeah, it's going okay. Absolutely burning through our trap disarm kits, though. Yeah, we're getting a lot of 20s. Why are we getting a lot of 20s? Watch how you go. There's a trap. Let's disarm. 18. Brilliant. Okay, so I'm guessing there's a few more over here. Beware. This place is trapped. 22. This one. Okie dokie. And I'm guessing or hoping this is the last one. There's a marble plate here as well. So I think I'm hoping these are the last two. I just got like four or five twenties doing that. Why can't I get that in combat? If, if I'd like toggled on some terrible... No, it's still on the same balance difficulty. Okay, whatever. Right, let's try this now. Be wary. This place is trapped. It's a gargoyle head there. Try that one. Right. Watch how you go. It's a trap. Let's disarm these. I can. Oh, 
Do I not lose a trap disarm kit? It's a set seven for a while if I successfully disarm the trap. All oh, right, yeah, I'm guessing if I fail, I lose the trap thingy. Let's try again. There we go. Getting less twenties now. It looks less suspicious. Right. Whoever that elf is, he's got an army of Shah worshippers in his. Do I hit this button first? I've already tried that one. So what if I tried this one? And then this one. Why can't I get to the button? Show me the button. Well, they all turn red. Okay. So what if I went this one? This one. Is there information here I'm missing out on? <laughs> I mean, the answer is definitely yes. Uh, and then this one. Because otherwise, at the moment, I'm just blind guessing and getting annoyed that, uh, that it's not working. Right, I'll go to it again. Right, let's read the plaque. Sosun Elg Olof. Okay. had a daughter. I wonder what happened. Right. I don't know what to do now. Have I tried every combination? I don't think I've tried that one, that one, and the front. Oh, there's a there's a plaque here. That's why. Sorry, plaque, a plate. That's why it's causing damage. There we are. Right, let's try that one. And then that one. Next time's the charm. Oh, there we go. Next Lovely. The charm. Door opens. Okay, skeleton on the floor. It's got a bone in him. That's pretty that pretty obvious. Right, let's go. Something over there. Oh, there's a diggy patch. Let's get a dig on. Come on, you spayed out. Let's go, mate. What we got? Oh, just some gold and a health potion and a jade. Yeah, I'm guessing this is a lift. Reversal gem. Oh, cutscene time? Yeah. I love how I'm on and just Karlak hesitantly jumps aboard. It's fantastic. Oh, mate, it looks like Shadowheart's gonna love this place. Everyone's got a cloak on now. Look how cool that is. Uh, right, okay, so we're in the gauntlet of Sha? I thought this was the temple of Sha. But never one quite so. Right, what's up and around here? Nothing. Up around here, potentially something. Who knows? There's a skeleton up here. There's a big stairwell. I'm guessing that that lift was put in after the collapse of the stairwell. That would make sense. Have a little look on the skelly. Yeah, I got some gold. Brilliant stuff. Seeing as I've gone pure paladin as well, I'm a little bit concerned that I'm only at 67 health. Karlak is at 30, uh, 68, and Will, who is a warlock fighter, is at 67. So, um, yeah, crazy. Shah, singer of eternal night, protector of the lost and forgotten. There's going to be enemies Cross in here. Cross from light into darkness. Give, Give your, your life, to the, life shadows. to the shadows. Here we go. Offer your pain to Shah's embrace. Hear the night song. Right, we're going to have a little look through this door. Oh, another plaque. The answer lies in darkness. More story Shows options. Must not be a vent? Must not be tricked. Oh, I can disarm this vent. The okay, well, I'm going to disarm Shows stuff as I go. Tricked. The umbral gem. Oh, jeez. Okay, never mind. Does that happen every time? Yeah, okay. Better than getting laid out on my back again. Third time lucky? No, nope, never mind. Perhaps that is how I can proceed. Can I shoot it? Does nothing. Statue? Pedestal? No, okay. Violence isn't always the answer. Oftentimes it is, but not today it would seem. So how do I get round this? Can I go round without getting blasted? Like, does anybody know Mage Hand? Repulsed again. But that glowing ring I saw may show. 
Right, maybe I just need to head down here. What are these? Oh, okay. More vents. Yeah, let's continue to disarm these, because I don't want to run back through and and hit them. Ardo lost condition guidance. Well, let's get some more. It's a cantrip. We cast at will. Okay, that's not going to work. Nat 1. Ah, oh, there's darkness. They're darkness vents. And we took some damage from something? Oh, is that because I failed? Oh no, we are just literally taking damage. Where's that money bank gone? Okay, get out of there. Come on, come on, quick. Can I get through here? Can I just attack that vent? Apparently not. Right, this I could be getting written off here by traps. Um, can I move up to here with a shadow heart? Disarm this trap. That would be useful, wouldn't it? Doesn't even get our own our own what's it called guidance bonus. That's fine. I don't have enough movement speed. Quick. Don't burn yourself. Garlac, you can at least get through. Still doesn't have enough movement speed because of the. Oh, John Carlac just misty step. Out of the way. There we go. With the people. I will. Can't see the vent. There it is. Well, there's the vent. Can't actually target it. Can't target that. Can't target that. Okay. Uh, click heels. Let's go, Will. Keep in pace. Right, now it's the environment's turn. All the traps are going to go off, I presume. Step carefully. There's a trap. Why has it got Will next? Carlac, right, surely. There must be a reason it's put me in turn-based mode. Add a bonus, add a guidance. Brilliant. We successfully disarmed that trap. Can't disarm this one, though, because Carlac's used her action. Let's disarm this one. Add bonus. Dark one's blessing. What is that? Oh, this one's every short rest. Okay, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna add that. We'll get an eleven. That will do it. Can I just leave turn-based mode? I can. All right. Go back to controlling Ardo and have a look in this tomb. There's a ring. Right. Oh, and there's a lever. What does that do? All right, lowers the light. These boots have seen everything. Okay, so if I lower both of these lights. Let's just bang out a short oh, rest, just to make sure everyone's kind of mostly alive. Disarm this marble plate with guidance. There we go. Head in here, I'm guessing there's another lever. There's another darkness trap. <clears throat> 22, that'll do it. This is probably like the, uh, the most puzzly bit I've experienced so far. Right, so just dropping those lights allow me to get close to this. No, nope, never mind. Yeah, ow, ow. That glowing ring's the key to this whole thing. I'm pretty sure I need to get that umbral gem. Because otherwise why would it be there and why would they be trying to push me away from it? So I'm gonna go over this way. There is a door. There is a marble plate. Let us disarm the marble plate. <clears throat> Excuse me. Critical success. Another 20. How many 20s am I going to roll? Let's hit that lever. Uh, potion of mind reading. That'll be useful. Let's disarm this as well. Because gods know I'm just going to run through here. Is that another crit? There's something wrong with the dice settings on this game. I'm calling myself out. Uh, yeah, let's add guidance again. There's no reason not to. Okay, we 
balls it up. Yeah, then it goes off, doesn't it? Desperately need to make sure... Oh my word! Yeah, and then we start taking damage. Then it probably throws us into turn-based mode. Shadowheart dies, despite the fact that it's her temple. There we go, we just sound it. Perfect. Let's disarm this one. 18. Brilliant. There'll be another vent there. I'm certain of it. Yeah. That's it. We'll stand on it, mate. It'll be fine. Another critical success. Right, what's in this tomb? Silver necklace. That has a resale value. Right, so that's all of the lights down. Then what? What's the deal? Oh, I can turn them off. I'm an idiot. The answer lies in darkness. It's so obvious now. Well, enough of Turn these off. Turn that off. Yeah, turn that one off. Oh, what's through there? Did I go through there? That glowing ring's the key to this old thing. Will has got a voice that makes him sound like he's from Driftmark. Do you know what I mean? Like he, he would be at home in the House of the Dragon. Okay, turning the lights off did not work. Oh, two more bloody lights on over here. Glowing ring seems better than getting laid out on my back again. Get rid of this one. Boom! All oh, right, bugger. Oh, was I just waiting for it to turn off? Oh, flipping hell. Better than getting laid out on my Is there another light that I'm missing? Is this one up here? Yeah, no, it's still not going to let me use it. Did anyone cast darkness? Glowing ring seems promising. Um, getting laid didn't out I on give it to again. someone? It's probably, it had to have been Shadow Heart. She's the only person I respect. Level one spell. I know I gave her light. Did I give her darkness? No, I gave her silence. No one stopped me yet. How do I pick up this flipping umbral gem? I'll give it a shot. The answer lies in darkness. Have I left a light on somewhere? Right. So when we're out here, it does that. Don't when we move in. That goes away? Yeah, no, not ideal. So, move out. Glowing ring seems promising. Yeah, Better glows. Laid out on my back again. Those are off, that's off, that's off, that's off. That's off, that's off. Are there any lights knocking about anywhere else? Or am I, am I just being really thick? Are you all just, like, shouting at the screen right now? Being like, Ollie, it is very clearly insert whatever the thing it very clearly is. The answer lies in darkness and I can't flip in grab it. Um I don't my sneak attention right now. Move Ardo off. My least sneakiest character that has full light on my fate armor. Yep, yeah, no, sneaking doesn't work. You can't trick the spells. That glowing ring seems promising. Better than getting laid out on my back again. What about Shadowheart? Shadowheart's a Shah worshipper. Oh, was it that easy? How do I use this? No one back home will ever right, I think this. that's that's it. Have we we're done it? What, did it? what did it do? I unlocked that door. We're not even going to go through that door. I think we're going to explore this way first. <laughs> Let's get another short rest in. We took a lot of damage just pissing around with that door. Let's see what's knocking about over here before we continue. There might be a really good piece of loot or an item that we need. We'll read the plaque. The rain of night comes in a thousand falling leaves. Okay, just an amethyst ring with full chasm creeper. Useful. Yeah, another ring with good resale value. Luckily, we disarmed all the traps, so 
we can just sprint back over to the other side and investigate the other wing before we move forward. I can't believe it was that easy. Turn off the lights, have Shadowheart touch it because she is a Shah worshipper. It was it was that simple. Right. It's squeaking. There's a plaque here on this one. The way to darkness, jump up here. Yeah. Beauty is equal and wealth unseen. Okay, a bit of gold. Sword and clothes still. Can I get up here from anywhere? Yeah, there's definitely a reason to go around here. Otherwise, why would the game designers put this in? There is something to find. I'm calling it right now. Yep, through here, onto here. There's a whole other chasm. Lovely. There is a way down here. Don't think I trust it. What I think I trust, he has a gilded chest. What I think I trust is jumping onto this mushroom, if I can. I cannot. Okay, down the Cragged Rock then. It's the only option. Mm. Let's head down. Another swarming toadstool. And I think it's over towards the gilding chest. Gilding? Gilded. Gilded chest. Looks like an ambush. Perception? What? What did I perceive? Oh, there's this thing, a cloaker. Oh, it's got 105 health. It's level 8. Got dark vision, light sensitivity, while in bright light, this creature has disadvantage on attack. Oh, okay. Multi attack on opportunity attack. Okay, well, look, I think 27 minutes into the recording, that is as good a place to leave it as any. Next episode, we will be fighting the crawler. So that seems like a nice, fun combat starty episode thank you so much for watching if you've got this far be sure to hit the like button leave a comment subscribe do all the great stuff popping up on your screen now will be some other videos i hope you find interesting please do check them out and i'll see you in the next episode